Okay, boy, boys, it's your suit chat back here, and I'm gonna beat that the little mini dungeon again, or at least attempt to beat it. So I'm gonna pick my class. I was the uh, Reaver. You can also see it's also this huge long story you can read too. And yeah. Also, you can use affinities. So it's common master dual wield, but right. I'm not I might just choose the same guy. But like the two-handed weapons were kind of kind of nice. This guy's literally all magic and staff. I'm just gonna be this guy again. Is that so? Interest. So we're in luck. No, you. All right, you heard all this guy's stuff. You also, I hear everything he says. He'll just take everything from this guy and sell it for a couple extra bucks. I just sneeze, dude. Okay, let's equip my weapons again. So I'm actually on permadeath still. So hopefully this next encounter, well, I, I have with the people don't I know about dying. I think this is just awesome. This is an awesome combo. I had a passive, I feel like it'd be really awesome. I can also do shield stuff. This guy has a, a proficiency with uh, two hand axes and shields. So I didn't realize is I actually have a for axes and swords. So I should probably be getting both or I should probably Again, both their skill trees and not just a dual wielding tree. So let's just get a passive in one of these skill trees. So it's an injury. That's not really helpful. Let's get this because he gives my sword some uh, crit efficiency. Let's see if that helps me this time. So last time, I didn't really need food, honestly. Just a ranged weapon this time. I think just going for another two-handed axe. Might just be beneficial for me. Let's go talk to them. the old elder. Get the mission. Okay. Farewell. Talk to the elder. Now let's go back to the tower. Actually, that is a different mission, by the way. I've gotten a different mission. I did not listen to what he said. If I would have known, I did not know that the mission he got from the other was different. That gives it so much more replayability. So much more. I need to go see the herbalist and actually buy some medicine. And this time, I need to buy, I need to buy one of these. Bye. And let's just. I can never have too much of these. And let's buy two splints. Rare 
a case, let's buy a bandage. Oh god. I don't really care about leeches. I feel like leeches are like a luxury item kind of thing. I don't need food because I got ham. Talk to this motherfucker again. Yeah, she sells a little bit different stuff. That's kind of cool. Okay. I crush. I don't really feel like talking to anyone else this time. I want to know where the water, what the well is. I forgot where the well is. So it's right here. Free water. I buy anything from it, it won't spoil. Why don't why would I want to buy an acorn? Just because I want to rest for probably rest while I'm getting attacked. I'm going to buy it. Oh, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna buy one more small tam. I feel like it'd be worth it. But it's gonna be worth it having one more small tam on me. Steal a bucket? Eh. Okay, so it's more than 120. I don't know why you buy sausage over smoke damn when for 26, 20 bucks more, get minus 25. Oh, because it's. Oh, because it gets 25, it gets 5, 15% more. Well, this gives 20% more, right? For 5% more, it's 20 more bucks. So I think, so sausage is actually, I think sausage is a better bang for a buck. I didn't realize the percentages were different. Okay guys, I'm gonna go do my mission, and hopefully not die this time. I'm gonna get real pissed if I die the second time without doing the mission. But it is different this time, which means everything I learned from the last mission is kind of SOL. They're not holding my hands anymore guys, it's a little difficult. Oh, I did bring more meds. That's what I learned. It seems like bandits attacking the road 24-7. Seems like it fuck you up, too. Um, hurt. Let's try to run away a little bit. My skill's back. Let's see how much this sells for. I think that guy needs swords. So I might just I might, might have to keep the sword for this mission. Oh. I apply leeches. Seems like I can't take off the leeches. I'll try to apply them. Yeah. 
What if you're supposed to fight these people and then retreat? It's before I even get there, I'm gonna attack by so many people. Ah, but fail again. I might have to fight these people and run back. Cause I'm already in some pain right now. I mean, I didn't even get the real challenge yet. Oh, maybe it's just cause I'm melee. I maybe mean, if I was range, it'd be a little bit easier. So maybe next time I'll pick up uh, a range weapon. Just to fight with the bandits. Penny bum, what's up? Okay, I can't eat it, so that's cool. Just put a low on me? So let's go down. Do, 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 do. Yeah, that was this. So there's a raspberry. Eat that. I spent all my gold, dude, preparing for this. Death cap. I'm not even picking that up. <laughs> I don't know what use a death cap mushroom is going to do for me. But it just sounds like I'm going to pick it up and die. Looks like I'm at the place. Probably gonna be someone outside. Yeah. I saw it's an archer. Yeah. Fuck, he's gonna hit me like three times before I get to him. This is literally the same exact area. Their shoes. Got to collect put stuff here. For now, I'm see if they're there for now. Okay, this is where I was last time. I'm a bit of pain. I can rest for like a second and then go. Got more healing this time. Taking it slow. There's a single guy here. Make a bait into this trap. Expect that to go horribly wrong. Yeah. 
How does everyone... <laughs> Chop this dude's head off, dude. <sighs> okay, this is better. More pen. Don't know. What, oh, it's broken. So it's better. I think it is better, but it's broken right now, so it's probably not better. I fucking whale this dude's head off. So a short bow. More than a pencil bow. Okay, let's break this box right here. Oh, well, I can't eat any more food because I'm satisfied. I'm in pain. Decent amount of pain. This increases my healing efficiency. Not really much of a pain thing. It's supposed to be. That's like the only pain thing I have is drinking a sip of booze. Bitch. What the fuck now, bitch? Also, it's not nearly as broken as mine. Okay, well... How's mine better? Oh, I didn't realize I had the fucking 20% fumble chance. That's... Makes sense. Two-handed axe book, that's cool. Chandelier. So it's better than there. Why? How much picking can I do with this? Oh, I don't. If it doesn't break, I do the infinite amount of times, basically. My bandage won't hurt. He's not pain still. A thirsty, I could drink. This is not good. Seems like it. Let's just go, let's knock off this right side. Let's 
seems like the right side's all cleared out. You guys don't really want to fight a Pokemon. I'm gonna hit right here so it kills both. We can't go on the booby trap at once. You bitch. Let's use this. And then let's heal myself up. So I can eat everything. Got free water, so I'm getting pretty golden. Okay, let's loot the rest of this place. Bandit side up. Hundred gold. That's fucking goaded. One clock time doesn't matter. Okay, this hide is a hundred gold. This lettuce is nope. Let's get out of here. Did the mission. A bit easier this time. Bringing supplies definitely help, helps. See, this is, these are dog belts, not worth much, right? But it makes me want to bring it just because it'll be interesting to some merchants. Who knows? Let's see. Yeah, I just need to go up. I could heal in town. Mm, I think I do fully heal over time. So I think I might waste some of my healing cells, heal, healing my body. Is there a road somewhere? Oh, that's right. They do so much freaking walking in this game. Hopefully I get a horse or something, that'd be cool. Or fast travel. Oh, looks like I learned a new s I forgot to level up, that's cool. I wasn't paying attention. Perception. I don't think I really need willpower. 
Health could be pretty nice for an attacker like me. Great, that's that's really a good one. Do not point vitality. Just levels evenly those three perks if you want to. That would be a bad. Oh, that's got a new skill. I learn. Fully blocking might be a really good skill. Let's get the fully blocking one. Just because blocking on that single attack could be really helpful. Because I can use my, fury, my flurry of strikes, right? And then I block. And then, or I could block in the beginning because it gets a counter chance, and then I do my period. I think I block in the beginning for the counter chance. Yeah, I think I want to block first. If I choose my skills, can I reorder these? So I thought that was a different place, but it just looks like the mill like swaps from sides. Maybe it's a different map, but it looked like those are the same quest. Uh, oh, okay. I think that was. That's just on top thing. It's crazy to me that they sent one mercenary to fight that many people. I'm about to teach you, I was hoping to learn from you. <laughs> That's funny. So you can teach me spear stuff? Mm, not really useful. I'm gonna fuck asleep in at this time of night. This time. Here for my reward. This place was captured by brigands. I don't plan to negotiate with them, but I also can't force them out with the troops I have at my disposal. We only have a few ma ma militiamen. God damn. Here and leave the village unprotected is not an option. Can't really count on the magistrate reinforcements as well. I like to know how exactly I'm doing. We don't know much either. A few days ago, Bork sent a car to the bridge perfect in us. Shipment ale, but the driver returned terrified and empty handed. He told us he spotted a group of bandits milling around the building. He turned back just in time, otherwise, he wouldn't be a share the story. When I sent a few guards to scout out, they confirmed that there were indeed five or six brigands on the brewing pump. Five guys? I have no idea what's happened to the place. His owner, all dead, I suppose. Hell, if I knew. If I known, I bet those are, are the scumbags that murdered Dwar, our previous miller, and then tried to squeeze money and supplies out of the rest of the village. I'm like, dude, I just a background check. I'm like, but yeah, I want to know what happened, right? Some background information. And this motherfucker is telling me, like, their life story, dude. All I want to know is how many people are going to be there, how hard they're going to be beat. I'm never clicking this button again. We managed to chase them all the time. They fled to the woods. Seemed like oh, they are back for vengeance. How long do I have to do this? 
Okay, this is a... F That's like a far one. Hmm. I'm on permadeath mode. I really don't want to die after rocking that far, dude. Holy sh shite. Okay, well. Another day. It's so foggy, what the fudge? I'm gonna go sleep in the tavern. Uh. So, for seven days, this will be 70, whatever counts it is. Is it cheap? I don't know how. I don't know if it's worth it how many days I should do it. Let's see. I'm just ready to go. I got 500 bucks. is worth it I mean for two weeks like am I gonna be here for two weeks uh, let's just get the one day well, let's see if there's gonna be anything else there. I just realized I didn't get the ring uh, let me sell some material to get pick up the ring. Does this sell us to the right people? Just drop some right now. Oh, pick up the ring. This she buys it for 188. I think she buys those for accurate price, right? No. I think I have to find each merchant in town to see if they give me a better deal on it. Don't want to get gypped. Up around, like, man, where's my post to sleep? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's sleep seven. Oh, okay, so sleeping is definitely worth it. Seems like that was a nighttime lady. One eighty eight, sixty three, three dollars. I sell both of those small tams. Okay, small tam. I got a sausage. I am gonna drink a beer though before I do my next mission. Seventy two ten. So they do give me different prices, which is fucked. Three. This guy buys way more stuff than the other people. Seventy one thirteen two two ten 
five. This guy. Sorry, guy. What are you selling? Dude, what's up? What are these shitty prices y'all give me? Hopefully the tail gives some better prices than these freaking scummies. <sighs> the king is dead. War. Da, 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 da. Uh, 80. That's the highest. 13. Let's sell these. Buy some gloves. Oh, I don't know if this is worth it. Four percent. Wonder about to buy some town gloves though, right? Oh, they are. Okay, let's sell. Uh, Uh, he gives me a pretty good deal on a lot of stuff. I haven't talked to this guy. This guy. Some of these guys just like hate selling stuff, huh? Give you a decent amount of money for your first quest. I think they restock a lot. I know it's boring to sell, but it's boring for me too right now too. Well, I wish I knew what merchants gave you the best prices. Cause this guy, so... Doesn't, the other guy bought the pelt for 80 and this guy doesn't buy for 80. I buy the book. Be the guy that sells scrolls. Let's just sell how the count stick, dude. So obviously count stick isn't worth picking up. This store right here and take it to my to get quest. Blacksmith, right there. Alky dude. There has to be someone that sells scrolls here, dude. Let's go with the tailor. I mean, tailor bought. I don't think for my money.
take these two guys together. So Taylor does sell a belt, but I already have a belt. I want to get some better clothes. I'm wearing a worn cloak. See, they give you a thousand, I have a thousand bucks right now, and they give you no direction. I want to spend money on. Because in most RPGs, you get a lot of your loot from a dungeon, right? But obviously, you don't get much of your loot from a dungeon in this game, right? So, the coat almost gives nothing. Go this guy. This guy is the only one I think that buys that book. Blackboard and obviously. Two. Well, I'm out of the video right here, guys. Thank you for watching. I'll see you all in the next one. Goodbye.